Greetings in the name of the Most High. We are now embarking on a heavy metal cleanse and a yeast and parasite cleanse because we know that the wrong worm and the tape worm can cause cancer. Do the research. We know that heavy metals can cause cancer too. Brain tumors, Alzheimer's, and Parkinson's disease. So what I did was we created a program for uh, heavy metal cleanse and ease and parasite cleanse at the same time. That program starts on the 12th of November, 2024. We're going to get, put it up on, on a PDF file. I want you all to follow it. I started already. This is my second day. I'm just on a fast. I clean up my whole digestive system. I'm not going to the bathroom for 10 days. So I won't be, me, won't be having a bowel movement for 10 days. Because I'm keeping my whole digestive system healthy. And I'm using my heavy metal detox formula. I'm draining my lymphatic system. I'm exercising. I'm sweating. I'm purifying the blood. I'm stimulating my organ system. And I'm tonifying the organs of elimination. So that PDF file will be up soon. We're going to be live tomorrow night on YouTube and on Facebook. Giving you instructions on how to go through that program. You can go to Patrick Dell's holistichealing.com and you can look look and buy the um, the heavy metal detox formula. Or you can call Ambrosia 718-469-0985 and ask him for the program, okay? But let's go over here now first. Now, don't be caught with your immune system down. Don't be caught, people. Because God put an immune system in us to protect us from cancer cells, viruses, yeast, parasites, and fungis. And in, any, in, in, in case we get any one of them, the Most High Yahweh also produced a system in us to repair what is damaged. It's called the immune system. So they are our protectors and they are also our healers. And no doctors could doubt that. But because we eat in the wrong foods, our immune system becomes compromised. And then the immune system cannot fight for us, causing us to get diseases long term. We're going to talk about inflammation and the type of inflammation. The type of Im inflammation stimulated by the PGE2 prostaglandin is involved in the formation of prostate cancer, breast cancer, and colon cancer. It's called PGE2. You have PGE1, you have PGE2, and you have PGE2. Three, sorry. The PGE1 is the good prostaglandin that prevents inflammation and prevents bad circulation in the cell membranes. But the PGE2 and the PGE3 is the bad prostaglandin that causes inflammation and can cause you to have or get all these conditions like prostate cancer, breast cancer, and colon cancer. So don't be caught with your immune system done and don't get too much inflammation. Ask your doctor to get what we call a sedative rate test or an ESR. Same thing. Do you all know that the PGE2 is also involved in autoimmune diseases like lupus, muscular dystrophy, celeridoma, Multiple sclerosis. Do you all know that? That the PGE2 prostaglandin is the bad guy. It's also involved in, the, in autoimmune diseases and plaque in the arteries that can cause troubles in the cardiovascular system. We call the heart. Do you all know that? Did you all know also that PGE2, the bad prostaglandins, can inhibit your natural killer cells, we call the NK cells or null cells, by what? By deactivating them. Do you all, did you all know that? Did you all know that the PGE2 can also inhibit the natural killer cells activity by what? By disarming those cells that hunt down and destroy malignant cells. Did you all know that? Did you all know that the PGE2 can, can inhibit those cells? And that's why you're not fixing your cancers? Cancers don't arise? And your doctor won't teach you these things? Did you all know that? That PGE2 bad prostaglandin 
can inhibit your NK cell activity by disarming these cells. And these cells are supposed to hunt down cancer cells and destroy them before they become malignant. We call it what? We call it initiation. We call it progression. We call it cancer. And we call it metastasis. These PGE2 can avoid that. So you have to keep your, 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 your white blood cells or the NK cells healthy. You call it the natural killer cells. Did you know that a low intake of vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin E, and beta carotene from pumpkins and also folic acid can be associated with a low immune response and greater risk for cancer? There are studies proving that. Do you all know that? Did you all know that low intake of vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin E, vitamin D3 also, which is also good for prostate cancer and beta carotene and also folate acid, which helps the division of the surface and the heart muscle. Do you know that they can be associated if they're deficient in a low immune response and greater risk for cancer if you don't get them in the foods? Did you know that low amount of zinc, which is a mineral, can cause the thymus gland to shrink prematurely, causing cancer to develop faster. Because we, the older we get is the, the more that, that gland shrink, but they don't lose the ability to function. But if we don't feed that particular gland zinc, that gland with zinc, with that, that gland called the thymus gland, will shrink prematurely. And because that gland produces thymosin to produce a T lymphocyte, it, it, your, your thymus gland is like a, like a university. All the gland, all the cells from the bone marrow come to that gland. And the thymus gland is like a university where, whereby he teaches each cell to function in a certain way. So he says, you cell, I'm going, to, I'm going to graduate you to be what? A killer of cancer cells. You cell, I'm going to graduate you to be what? To kill viruses. You cell right over here, they're coming to my thymus gland from the bone marrow. I'm going to, I'm going to teach you to go and kill yeast and fungi and parasites. Did you all know that? See? But if there is no zinc in that particular gland, he shrinks prematurely and he loses the ability to function for you. And when you get cancer, you can't fix it. No doctors can do that. So what we're going to do now, I want to teach you what I'm doing today. So I have some garlic. I have some ginger. And I have some lemon. And because I'm on a I started my program, I started my, heavy, I started my heavy metal program already, before everybody else. I like, to, I like to create a hostile environment internally to cancer. Because remember that cancer can still stick on the vascular walls. But remember that cancer cannot stick in certain uh, uh, walls that have cartilage. You have to strengthen those. So what it is, I have elderberry, I have blueberry, I have um, blue, um, black currant in here. I'm going to mix it with my ginger and my, and my, um, my uh, uh, garlic and my lime and lemon with the seeds. I'm going to juice them. I'm going to show you what I'm doing. See? You extract them. Yeah? Ginger is what we call a natural radiation. But ginger also is important. For what? For a damp condition of the lung. If you can mix ginger with orange peel and you have a damp condition of your lung, ginger works well for that. Don't forget that. A damp condition of the lung. A cold, damp condition of the lung. Ginger is good for that. Put your lemon. Yeah, the ginger. Everybody's me alone. Bear with me, please, because there's only me alone over here. And I'm trying to do that to teach my people. Cancer is on the rise, and nobody else teaching you how to prevent cancers. It's killing our people. Ginger, the boss. Lemon, and then I'm going to drop two grain of garlic. Yeah. I'm 
I don't make no joke. I don't want no cancer developing my system. I don't want cancer developing my system at all. So we have to prevent cancer. Right here. So what I do is, now, I remove the pulp, and I will take the pulp, and I will make a tea with the pulp. See? And I put it in my, in my pot with some sea moss, you know? And I boil it, and I drink it. So I'm getting the juice, and I'm making the pulp into a tea also, so you can have protection. Yeah. Protection, we call it. So what I do now is, I take the ginger, I take the garlic, I take the lemon after I juice them, and I pour them in my blueberries. Yeah. And my elderberries. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. And my black currant. Because they are the foods that help the immune system to function. And then I take what? My heavy metal cleanse. I put 40 drops of my heavy metal cleanse in here. And I take 40 drops of my lymphatic drainage to, to, to drain my lymphatic system. Because remember now, I am removing heavy metals from what? From the liver, the spleen, the kidney, and the brain. And I drain my lymphatic system because the kidney and the lymph system work together. I'm going to drop that inside here, 40 drops of this inside here. And then what I like to do is, you can get a mortar and a pestle. You could, you could grind your, your garlic and your onion. And you, could, you could juice them also. Or you could blend them too. And I take one drop of peppermint oil. Yeah? And I drop it in there. And what it does, it prepare my digestive system for what I'm going to drink here because it helps to remove debris from my digestive system. People have to learn these things because cancer is going to rise. It's raging all over. Young people getting it. Older people getting it. Women getting it. Men coming in with prostate cancer at an alarming rate. Yeah? Women coming in with breast cancer at an alarming rate. Yeah? Yeah? What we doing? Hey, medical system ain't teaching us nothing. How to fix these things. So then we become ignorant of the fact that we just eating and regular, eating regular, we ain't cleaning, we ain't detoxifying the organ system, we're not purifying the blood, we're not dealing with stimulation of the organs, we call it stimulation in, the, in Chinese medicine, we're not tonifying the organ, we call it tonification in Chinese medicine, we're not dealing with blood purification, yeah, we're not purging, we're not sweating, and we're eating a food that is causing our organs to become bloated, and once these organs become bloated, you are going to get an autoimmune disease because it increases the function of your PGE3 and your PGE2. And they are the guys that destroy your NK cells. They are the guys that inhibit yeah, your good prostaglandins in the cell membranes and cause you to get a cytokine storm. You drink this. Now, when I drink this here, three to four cups per day, I create a hostile environment into my system. So cancer cannot develop. Because what? I stimulate my organ system. You, you know, I, 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 I want to mention this though. If your organs are weak and you have cancer in your liver, you cannot use the therapy called stimulation. You have to tonify. And after you tonify, you can stimulate. You can't stimulate your organs if it's, if it's weak. Because if your organs are weak and you stimulate those organs, those organs will collapse. You have to learn good herbal medicine. In order for you to know how to treat an organ or to treat an illness, you can't stimulate an, a weak organ, but you can tonify that weak organ and after that weak organ is strong enough to throw off the sickness, now you can stimulate the organs with foods and, and juices and throw off the sickness. And then you have to deal with blood purification. You must purify.
purify the blood from acid and toxins. And if you can do that with these programs, cancer will never get into your system because you will create a hostile environment. You will have the good fats than the bad fats. You will increase potassium more than so sodium. You will do it sweating. You will purge regularly. Yeah. And you will prevent initiation. You will, be, you, 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 you will prevent uh, carcinogen or carcinogenesis. Initiation of a cancer cell. You will prevent progression of a cancer cell. You, you, you will prevent cancer from developing. And you will prevent metastasis cancer because cancer feeds on your, on, your, on, your, on, your, on, your, on your food that you eat from the blood vessels. He creates more of them. So if you could do these things on a regular basis, you can decrease the amount of carcinogens and free radicals that get into your system and steal your electrons causing you to get cancer long term. So, join us on the 12th of November, 2024 on our yeast and parasite cleanse three days before the full moon and four days after the full moon killing tapeworm, pinworm, hookworm, treadworms. And in the process, we go to the brain with what? Heavy metal detoxification of the brain, of the spleen, of the liver, of the kidney. You see? And we're moving the heavy metals out. And we're doing deep breathing and we're creating oxygen in the cells. See? And no cancer can develop. And that's how, you, that's how you prevent cancers. That's how you prevent autoimmune diseases like lupus and cerebellum, muscular dystrophy, myasthenia gravis, hmm? saccharidosis. See? By, by keeping inflammation at bay. Increasing your, P, your, your PGE1 and your PG2 and PGE3. Bless and love to everybody. Don't forget, Patrick Doves, holistichealing.com. Go to the website and, and get your heavy metal cleanse formula and get your lymphatic drainage formula. And tomorrow, we're going to have a live video and we're going to give you instructions on how to get rid of all these things in your system, even though they're, even though they're indoors. Okay, so bless and love. Go to the website, Patrick Doves, holistichealing.com. Patrick Doves, holistichealing.com or call Ambrosia 718-469-0985. All them other, all them other number the scammers. Watch for the scammers now. My number is 631-530-2329. And let us embark on a program together and make sure that you teach your family, your family members, to do these programs regularly. And when you do this program, the hospital, the sick care building will never see them and their children. Because the hospital is hospice. H-O-S-P-I-C-E. Hospice. Don't forget. Hospital is hospice. You go in there, you either die in there, or you come out. It's hospice. Don't forget. Hospital is hospice. Call a sick care building. Bless and love. The program starts on the 12th of November. Yeah? We're going on a, on a 14 to 21 day program to get rid of heavy metals. And also get rid of excessive amount of parasite in the liver, in the in the spleen, in the in the in, in the in the intestines, and in the brain. And get rid of and we're gonna to go to the several several cortex of the brain. We're gonna to go to the ganglia of the brain. We're gonna to go to the frontal lobe of the brain that did the personality. We're gonna fix these things. And only then you're gonna see a difference in how you feel. Blessed love, don't forget Patrick Dells, holistichealing.com. Ambrosia Health Food, 718-469-0985. No other than these two. Yeah? Or 631-530-2329. If you are in Grenada, call 473-420-40856. Blessed love. Cancer. Patrick Dells, yes, cancer. What's going on? Ain't nothing going on, cancer. How come I can't come in? Sucker, you can't come in. Why not? You see I'm creating a hostile environment to your ass? Oh, okay, okay. Are you going to teach the people? Yes, cancer, I want to teach the people. I want to get into them, though. But if I teach them, you can't get in. Oh, we got to get rid of you, Patrick. Blessed love, everybody. Give thanks.